Breaking news in Alhambra this morning where police have surrounded a home. That person uh, in, the, in the home may be the suspect wanted in the fatal stabbing of a 17-year-old high school student on Friday. KTLA's Alina Bovian on the scene with the very latest for us. Alina, good morning. Frank, Jessica, good morning. You know, at this point, all we're hearing is that the LAPD Alhambra police are looking for a murder suspect, but they will not specify which murder suspect. Now, it is worth pointing out that just about 10 minutes ago, we were at Wilson High School. That is where 17-year-old Xavier went to school. We were there on a different story to show some new surveillance video. When we heard the choppers, we heard the commotion and moved over here because, again, it is very likely because of the proximity to the school that this is connected to the stabbing death of that 17-year-old. Now, just take a look behind me here. This is where it is all happening. We have SWAT that just moved in. Alhambra police is here. LAPD is here. We have about 20 police units. This is, again, just about two miles away from Wilson High School, where Xavier went to school. We're talking about Xavier Daniel Charvin, who was stabbed to death last Friday. There is a perimeter set up around a home here in this neighborhood. This is the 2200 block of Westmount Drive in the city of Alhambra. It's possible there is a suspect barricaded inside the home. This is a residential neighborhood. As you can see, lots of homes here, lots of people. It's early in the morning. Everyone just getting ready to leave the house for work or for school. Many people wondering what is going on here. Now, we've been speaking with officers on the ground. No official word yet on what this is all about and if it is connected to exactly Xavier, but we do know that they are looking for a murder suspect. Now let's show you Xavier because again, we were sent out to this area earlier this morning to show you some new surveillance video in reference to that suspect. This is Xavier here. He was a straight A student, an honor roll student at Wilson High School. He was out on the sidewalk waiting for his mother to pick him up last Friday when he was suddenly and brutally stabbed to death. New this morning is this surveillance video. Take a look. This was released by the LAPD. The video captures the moments before the attack. The suspect is seen walking around a parking lot with the knife in his hand. The boy is out of frame, but it appears the suspect is walking toward the boy. This happened last Friday on the 4500 block of Valley Boulevard around 3:55 in the afternoon. Police say this was a random, unprovoked attack. The same guy in this video may have been responsible for another random attack another stabbing just a few hours later. Police are now following up on leads, including the suspect's vehicle, a black 1996 to 2001 SUV, a Honda CRV, which was parked near where Xavier was stabbed. The boy then ran to a nearby King Torta and asked for help before collapsing on the floor. The gentleman was waiting for his mom right here in the sidewalk. Never knew this was going to happen. He just a uh... It's one of those cases he was at the wrong, wrong time, wrong place. It's the good thing that they know, they have a picture, and hopefully he's not going to be out there so long. And here's another look at the suspect's video. According to the LAPD, he is described as a male Hispanic, long, wavy black hair with a long beard, wearing a long black jacket with a black shirt underneath, black pants, black shoes, and a black baseball hat with white writing. And take a look at this. This is from LAUSD Superintendent Alberto Caraballo. He released this statement saying, when something goes wrong with a kid like that, the entire community should bow its head. We have to think about what's happening in Los Angeles. We have a distraught principal who knew this student who has done everything right. Now back out here live just to show you the scene here again. We are in Alhambra again, just a few miles away from Wilson High School where the young boy was stabbed near the high school rather, and so it is possible that this may all be connected. We are waiting for the LAPD to give us an update. We're told we will get word soon, but in the meantime, you can see lots of activity happening here surrounding a home here in Alhambra. We have SWAT. We have roughly 20 police units, so they certainly are treating this as a very big deal, a very hostile situation. We will have more Hopefully, uh, we will get an update from LAPD. But that is the very latest. We'll send it back to you.